thought I'd better go in there, right, the two of us. Maybe I could have a lift one day, eh? But until then, I think it's back to Tony. What do you, do you fancy being a pilot, Tony? Yeah, 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 de definitely. I've always wanted to actually go up in charge of being in control. Well, they stop behind. They've got their music mission t shirts on. So let me just explain what the music mission is. We sent out stacks and stacks and stacks of uh, entries and had over 8,000 schools taking part. And, um, can I look at your t shirt? Yeah. Music mission. There was a chocolate bar. Anyway, we had over 8,000 schools take part, sent Mark Goodyear and a few other experts to go and listen to the songs, and the standard was really, really high. In fact, Stock Aitken Awardsman could well be out of a job in a couple of years' time, because we know some good new songwriters. Anyway, what we're going to do is we've whittled it down to uh, six, and uh, we're going to show two each week, and then you'll get a chance to actually vote on it. Anyway, I will let the man who has a cheesier grin than Ken Dodd explain. Here comes Mark Goodyear and the Up To You music mission. And maybe, um, have you got a T-shirt my size? So, underneath the same sky, but not the same cloud because the weather's a lot better a hundred miles further north. We're outside Pelsall Community School in Walsall to meet our second finalist. His name is Richard Gray and if he wins Music Mission he's in no doubt where he wants to be. His song is called At The Top. Well Richard, I don't know how long it took you to write the song but you must have been in a good mood while you did because it's a very happy song, isn't it? It took me about a day to write but um, yeah, because I, I just finished, finished my exam so that must have influenced it a bit. And you wrote the song in this room too, which is so tiny it would be enough to depress anyone. Yeah, well, I had a bit of problems because the phone kept ringing every now and then. <laughs> and there's wires scattered all over the place and everything. Were the lyrics or the music easiest to come by? I found the music easiest to write because I've had more experience of writing music. I wonder, does music occupy all of your spare time or is there perhaps a, a little room for other hobbies? Well, I do a bit of painting as well, and it's sort of linked with music at the same time. Like, I can do a picture and write a bit of music to go with it as well. Break a leg, and I keep standing up. What's the time? I never run out of love. Can you see what's keeping me? got a really good chance. I know it's a difficult thing to get into, but I think something like this is exactly what he needs. Um, he asked me a few months ago, sir, how do you get into the music business? And uh, I said, uh, if I knew the answer, I wouldn't be sitting here talking to you. <laughs> so no matter what the result of Music Mission, how determined are you? Is music your career for life? I plan to get a job in music, yeah. I suppose if all else fails with your artwork, you could always design record sleeves. That's my brother's ambition, so I think I'll stick to music. <laughs> all right, good luck and thank you, Richard. OK, thanks a lot. So that's it for week one of Music Mission. Next week, we'll take a look and a listen to finalists number three and four. Now it's your turn to take part this week. If you preferred Annabelle Walker's Clouds of Love, dial this number. Or if you preferred Richard Gray's At the Top, change it, please. Thank you. Dial this number. Call now and phone your vote in. And remember, it's up to you. It's up to you. It's up to you. It's up to you. Up to you. Cheers, Mark. Love the smile. OK, let's have a quick recap on how to vote. Here comes the catch and a key. Now, Annamal Walker is 0898991241. And Richard Gray is 0898991242. Can the computer just quickly show how the nation's choice is doing so far? Keep on. That's a brilliant cartoon. Listen, it's a tense moment now. The palms of my hands are sweating. I'm nervous for everyone. Yep. Uh, but we have the results, the final result of the Cadbury's Music Mission competition, and Jason is going to read them out. But okay. first of all, he's going to tell us what they're going to win. Okay, there's pretty good prizes. Okay, excellent they? prizes. Fantastic prizes. The first prize is a track recorded at one of the London's top recording studios, Master Rock Studios. Number two, it will then be passed on at, uh, what is that? Making, making Records. records. It would be pressed at Making Records in South London. 
And then number three, one of the top record companies, Music Enterprises, will distribute it. So basically, you're going to get a record, everything. That is a, a wow thing. of yeah. a prize. It yeah. really is. And something else that we haven't said is that Up To You are going to make a video yeah. of all the recording and, uh, and we'll be able to share that on next week's programme. So, Look at these four whew. people. Okay <laughs> then, <sorry> for, <laughs> for the results, okay. Jason. Don't know, we got a drum roll? Is there a drum roll? I don't think we get things like that. <laughs> okay, so number three. We got it. <laughs> <laughs> the reaction. Richard Gray with 18%. Yeah, yes. come on everybody in the studio. Congratulations to Richard Gray. Congratulations. Woo! 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 <laughs> <laughs> but number two. Amon with 39%, which oh, is pretty good. Congratulations, Amon. Yes! <laughs> and of course, number one is Roland and Vandana with 43%. Yes! Excellent. Congratulations, Brilliant. guys. Congratulations. Congratulations. And listen, we must say as well that um, everybody yeah, is the winner because okay. you've entered this competition and have whittled down from over 6,000 entries. They've all done brilliantly well. And it doesn't mean that they won't all end up with a career in the music business. So lots of congratulations there. It's only a pity that uh, we haven't got any champagne or anything like that. <laughs> so how do you feel? Uh, I'm great. I'll go into the last three. Yeah. <laughs> that, that was an achievement in itself. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah. So right. tomorrow you're going to be packing your bags? Definitely. Well, in fact, tonight you're going to be packing your bags because you've got to be near the recording studio tomorrow. Ah. <laughs> tonight I'm going to be doing something else rather than packing. But... Celebrate. <laughs> All right, then. Let's go and say goodbye to the OB who are in Edinburgh. Well done, Roland. I wanted well, you to win. Well. Yeah. Good luck with that. Uh, and yeah, everything here, the fringe, the festival, it's all going on for the next three to four weeks. Quickly, hello to all the girls from Heathfield and Golden Spring. Oh, cool. And you have to, uh, the, the theme is Spain, isn't it? The weather's like Spain as well. Comes the rain, yes. comes the rain. This is a vile racket. You didn't raise much, Jenny. No, I know, I think I need to. Man oh, thank you very much indeed. I think I'm going to join in with a bar. <laughs> Goodbye, we'll see Bye. you next week. Edinburgh, listen, we've had a brilliant Saturday morning, we have, haven't we? Definitely. We it's have. Fantastic. And have you we have all? a you have a good yeah. week. Yeah. Yeah. Have a good holiday. Congratulations to everybody. And we'll see you next week. See you then. See bye, ya. bye bye. bye. bye.